At number 10, the Prime Minister and officials broke lockdown laws. Brazen excuses were dreamed up. Day after day, the public was asked to believe the unbelievable. Ministers were sent out to defend the indefensible, making themselves look gullible or foolish as they did so. Collectively, this has made the government look distinctly shifty, which has consequences that go far beyond political unpopularity. No government, no government can function properly if its word is treated with suspicion. The lack of trust in the elected portion of our democracy cannot be brushed aside. Parliament has a duty to address this and correct this. And if it does not, and trust is lost at home, our politics is in no man's land, in disarray, broken. If trust in our word is lost overseas, we may no longer be able to work effectively with friends and partners for mutual benefit or even security. Unfortunately, that trust is being lost and our reputation overseas has fallen because of our conduct. We are weakening our influence in the world. We should be wary. Even a casual glance at overseas comment shows our reputation is being shredded.